the things I think we enjoy here at St Andrews is having different master's programs which enable people who've really been excited by the subject at undergraduate level and perhaps a little bit of further study elsewhere to come and do quite a sustained energetic program which isn't yet at PhD level but might well prepare them for PhD level or prepare them at least to go on in a better informed way than they were before into whatever other career path they may be heading. And the uh, reason for doing a master's in analytic and exegetical theology is that I think there probably isn't anywhere else where you can do this kind of thing, bringing together two apparently quite different disciplines which haven't been talking to one another that much, if at all, and actually doing some hands-on stuff in terms of some of the great issues as what is history and why does history matter for the Christian and how do we think historically about God becoming human and if history matters, why is history such a mess and is there a problem of evil and if so, how can we analyze it and address it? And all too often, biblical scholars have done that one way, if they've done it at all, often they've just parked it. Systematic and other theologians have done it another way and haven't really engaged with the Bible. And I think it's hugely exciting on the basis of our experience here so far to have master's students being able uh, to engage with these questions themselves in dialogue with professors who are themselves trying to work things out and actually to be part of the conversation, to have a sense that this is a forward movement and we are going somewhere and we're going somewhere together. So I think that chance for a master's program is really quite remarkable, probably unique at the moment in the world, though I would like to think others will follow. What I've really appreciated about the vision of the Lagos Institute has been the interdisciplinary focus, uh, the fact that we're trying to bring in philosophy, theology, and biblical studies. Uh, that's what immediately caught my eye when I first saw this post last year. Um, the excitement of seeing silos torn down uh, in terms of collaboration and different scholars coming together and thinking about big questions that could actually impact the world and society and the church. That's what excited me the most. And then secondly, relatedly, is the fact that the heart of the Institute is to bridge the gap between the academy and the church. Uh, to serve both institutions, I think, is a powerful vision and one that I was very excited to be a part of. And why study for an MLIT here in the Logos Institute in St Andrews? First, because we are bringing biblical scholars, analytic philosophers and theologians together to teach students to think in rigorous and informed ways about the most important questions it's possible to ask. Second, because it provides a degree with international standing. And thirdly, because it opens the door for students to consider pursuing PhD studies once they've completed their MLIT. Here we have obviously Tom Wright and then we have a couple of Torrance's lecturing and then just for visiting scholars we have Peter Van Inwagen, uh, Mike Ray, C. Stephen Evans and then we have Oliver Crisp as well so just being able to interact with them has been absolutely incredible. I appreciate that in an era that feels increasingly divided and divisive that the Logos Institute seeks to build bridges both in and outside the academy. So through interdisciplinary dialogue and um, good academic rigor, the Logos Institute shows a way forward um, with courage and with connectivity, um, not just for the students in it, but for the communities that it is active in. As a master's student at the Logos Institute, you have the opportunity to develop as a theologian by learning a, a way of synthesizing theology, biblical studies, and philosophy in a way that I think shows tremendous benefit for the Christian church in the 21st century. Whether you have a background in any of these fields, the Logos Institute will enhance the way you think about Christian theology and the way you communicate it. Plus, spending a year in an idyllic and historic venue such as St. Andrews isn't such a bad deal.